Hello guys, today I'm going to be doing a top 5 cases for the Samsung Galaxy S4 video. Now first of all I want to say is the back is off on the Galaxy S4, but it all these cases fit with it on. It's just because I want to show you some why it's cool with the back off and stuff like that. So let's get started with the first case. And I also want to mention the all these cases are from minisuite.com and I'm not just saying this because they sent me these cases. The cases are some of the coolest I've seen and the most technical cases you could get. So the first one is sort of a protection case. It's heavily padded and if you dropped it, let's just say it would definitely not break. So let's go ahead and pop the Galaxy S4 in it. It's quite easy to pop in. It's really easy to press the on and off buttons here. Um, you see a little hit and it's on, a little hit, it's off. Volumes, volume buttons are easy too. So it's not one of these hard shell cases which are really hard to push the button on. So on the back, as you can see, because I always have to say as you can see, it has a slide sort of thingy. So if I pull this up, you see that sticks out. You just stick it out until it clicks and then you can watch videos like that with it holding it I'll show you a quick example I won't do this for all you see you can just watch videos and it automatically rotates you can also watch them that side up as you could see you could also hold play it oops play it that way up it's not as stable as this way, but it still does work pretty well. So that is the first case. I'll link all these cases in the description in order of which I talked about in the video. So that's a very good case. And all these cases are pretty good value. So let's take that off and go to the next case. Now the next case is in two pieces. Now the reason it's in two pieces is because it's... A clip case as you can see you clip that onto your sleeve or whatever you want to clip it on if you're running jogging and you want to listen to music you clip that to your sleeve let's say my arm was my sleeve and then you run with it the other bit of it this bit you pop it in it's just you know a normal case nothing too secure it's not too secure i mean the phone is secure but it's not got padding up there on the side on the volume keys and down here then once you've got this in face down you just want to slide it in like this really easy to do it clicks in and then you see you you can just clip it onto your sleeve you drop it it's completely padded on the bottoms here it has these this it's cased it's protected on the top too it has this bit here and it's really secure now and you just clip it onto your sleeve and it's really cool or not on your sleeve anything you want and it's really easy to get out you just slide it up and then take it out so that's the second case now let's go on to the third case the third case is a more minimalist case which doesn't necessarily mean it's bad. It is a see-through case, sort of cloudy see-through. And what makes this so cool is that when you don't have the back on, you just slide it in. It's really protective. It protects all every single side of your phone. And the buttons again are really easy to press. Volume buttons here are really easy to press too. You don't have a protect, it doesn't protect your USB thing, it doesn't have a flap for that, but that's alright, and your microphone too, but that's normal, your camera's fine, and this is why it's so cool. You've got a case, but it looks like you don't, and you can see the whole back of your phone. You see that? And I think that looks pretty cool, but maybe if it's raining, I wouldn't put this case on, because in case the rain seeps through here and gets down to the battery and stuff like that, so that's the third case. I really like this case, even though it's the simplest. I think it looks really cool. And you can also, you can put 
for example, I'll show this flip case. You can put a flip case on it and put it in the case. I'll show you. I'll come right back when it's on. So the flip case is on, as you can see. It is a flip case. So now with this case, you just flick it in. Just take that up while I'm putting it in. And you've got see through the pink. You've got the volume buttons here, which even with the flip case, they still work. And it works fine. I have to be honest, with the flip case on, I wouldn't recommend having it on too. Because the volume buttons, you see they're there. When you want to press down, it works. Up, it works, but it's a little harder than you'd want it to be. So that's the third case. Now let's get on to the fourth case, and then the fifth one. So the fourth case is a complete sh um, shell shock case, I'd call it. You drop this and it'll break the floor, not the phone. It's like that iPhone 5, that iPhone case that it sort of has like, I don't know, lizard skin looking sort of design. You can see that there? It's got that sort of design. It's got shiny sides, volume buttons. You see it just, it comes out the actual volume button so it's really easy to press. And everything's protected, obviously, except for camera and the usual stuff, which if they were protected, they would distort the sound and the camera. You wouldn't be able to take pictures. So this also does come with another flick out thing to watch videos. Just pull it back. And you just put it down and you watch videos like that, like the other case. So not only is it shell shocking proof whatever you want to call it, shockproof. It also has the thing at the back so you can just put it down, watch a video and put it back down, flick it and if you drop it nothing will happen. Sides, bottom, it's completely, it's invincible this one. I would do a drop test but I don't I say it's invincible, I do not want to risk hitting the screen on something, pointing out from the ground and breaking it. So I won't do that. So now let's get on to the fifth and final case, which is a sort which is different sort of design. It's a leather case, but it's a cool leather, it's a different sort of leather case, so let's get to it. So this leather case, it's absolutely bloody easy to put on. You see, I've already got it on and it fits perfectly. It's not falling out. You can see it's not going to fall out. You got easy flick in. When you open it, it unlocks, which is pretty cool. You see here, I'll show it again. You see? The phone detects that and it closes when it, it turns off when it closes. It's not even magnetic, I don't think. So what makes this different from the other leather case is this bit. You can watch DVD, you can watch films if you go like that. And it's a so it's also a stand case like the other ones. You see that? It's really, really cool, clever. It cool and clever. You see, it comes like that, you go down, and then you should attach it and you can watch videos. It's it feels really good in the hand, it's really comfortable. It's heavy padding on the front, on the back, very strong too. And I'd say that this one is my favourite out of all of them for daily use and protecting because the corners are each protected here. You see they're hard. It's hard here, hard here and hard here. So those that is my review of the top five cases for the Samsung Galaxy S4. As you can see, they all had their own unique features and they were cool in their own way. So check, uh, check minisuite.com out. I guarantee you'll love it. And the prices are very, very affordable. So thanks again. Comment, subscribe, like, share and follow me on Twitter. Peace out, guys.